Mad Kiki. She brings the energy, the excitement, and the range every time she steps on the court. Makia Herbert Harrigan's time at South Carolina is spilled with moments she'll never forget. It's very heartbreaking, you know, knowing that we really had the pieces and uh, was, I felt like we were well on our way to win a national championship and just to have it all cut short, you know, when you can't really do anything about it. But I mean, I just had to turn the page. And in eight days, Herbert Harrigan will do just that when her name is called in the WNBA draft. Early in the season, she was under the radar. But as the year went on, her play continued to rise. After her SEC Tournament MVP performance, she's played herself into consideration for the first round. I mean, it's been great just seeing, like, you know, all my hard work. And a lot of people, I was slept on, you know, especially early in the season. But, I mean, just to see that everybody's, you know, uh, you know, seeing what I could do now. There was a time where Mad Kiki had her foot out the door, but she stuck with the Gamecocks. During her final years in Columbia, her play on the court wasn't the only skill set she improved. Her mindset has evolved off the court. I remember Coach Steady always telling me um, she can't get to my skill set if I'm on the bench, you know, because of, you know, getting angry and stuff like that, because that kind of threw me off my game. But, I mean, throughout uh, the past years, I've just been uh, working on my maturity and um, just trying to grow. Growth. It's essential on the court, but just as important off of it. And that's why Makia is ready to take on the WNBA next.